Reverse flies, bent over, head supported, single arm, dumbbell. Single arm reverse flies target the upper back muscles. If you perform a lot of pressing movements, you're going to want to use exercises like the reverse fly to avoid shoulder niggles and injuries. It's all about structural balance. In this bent over single arm variation, you'll need a box or a bench to rest your head on. Stand with the feet roughly shoulder width apart and hinge at the hips to rest your head on the elevated surface. I often place my forearm under the forehead for comfort. Make sure your back is flat. Holding a dumbbell in one hand, initiate each repetition by retracting and depressing the shoulder. Think about pulling your shoulder blade back and down. Do not allow the shoulder to shrug up towards the ear. Once the shoulder is set, lift the arm to the side at roughly a 90 degree angle away from the torso. A common mistake is to raise the arm to the side at an angle less than 90 degrees. Try not to make this mistake. As you lift the arm, you want to rotate the shoulder internally so the pinky finger points towards the sky. This helps to target more of the posterior delt. At the top of the movement, focus on pinching your shoulder blade towards your spine while keeping the shoulder depressed. Then reverse the movement and lower the weight back to the starting position, allowing the shoulder to relax at the bottom of the rep. Maintaining a flat back and keeping your head in touch with the bench or your forearm during the entire movement is essential. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel.